Welcome to USL E-Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX. We have reached the knockout stage. 16 teams remain, and it's Philadelphia Union 2 taking on El Paso Locomotive. With Devin Kerr, Mike Watts on hand. Devin, we move to the best of five in the knockout rounds. Mike, you and I petitioned to go 10v10 during this game, but unfortunately the committee knocked us down. So guess what? We're going to stay 1v1. Still a best of five series in the sense that, yeah, everybody else in these eight matches is going to have to deal with it. Look at the bracket. Some spicy fixtures. How about Tucson and Madison bottom left? Indy Birmingham. That could prove quite interesting. Let's take a look at who's playing in this one. Evan Slabicki really impressed. He's been around the club now for three and a half years. He plays for City Team Chester. 3-0 for Philadelphia, Mike, and Group 3 champion. How about you take a look at El Paso Locomotive, Group 4 runner-up, and Logan Ketter are 2-1. But that second victory, oh so critical. He put up a 40 spot in this third game. No big deal. He's got a boatload of momentum coming into the knockout rounds. So we've got Philadelphia and El Paso meeting in the knockout stage when we return to USL E Cup Rocket League Edition. Mom, we have to talk. I'm getting a little too old for notes in my lunchbox. Really? Okay. See what else I put in there? Little Bites! Entman's Little Bites Muffins. Bye, Mommy, I love you! Made with real ingredients like blueberries, bananas, strawberries, and no high fructose corn syrup are always baked moist and delicious. Entman's Little Bites. The perfect portion of happiness. It's USL E Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX. Two teams from the USL Championship Philadelphia Union 2 in gray, in blue, El Paso Locomotive. Devin, some players wait a lifetime for this. These two players have waited a couple weeks for the opportunity to play in a knockout stage. Mike, what about the hours you and I have been sitting around going, hey, hey, we know you're playing each other. We know what's going on. We know you're training in the background. We know there's code red over there. Let's get it on. Slabicki, not once, but twice! He's got the opener. Okay. We see you. I said, this is going to be a very, very, very juicy fixture. Only because most of the juice is coming out of the boys from the Northeast. Philadelphia Union 2, watch the move. 50th goal of the tournament for the Group 3 champion, Philadelphia Union 2. Ketterer caught a bit out of sorts here. Slabicki. Angle's difficult. Ketterer, as typical, makes the save. Ketterer cuts forward. Launched inside, Slabicki off the post, backs up. Does he get a second crack at this? Ketterer drives it away. Ketterer caught out. Slabicki to take a two-goal lead. Captain can make it happen, Mike. It's that tiny little deflection coming off the backboards, coach. Oh, Mark Lowry sitting at home in utter disgust. He understands that his man was out of position. Here's Ketterer grabbing one back. That was a necessary goal to potentially swing the momentum. Yeah, and I think it's an important to notice, Mike. It's not just the momentum. It's the way that he went about it. Right off the restart, getting stuck in. That's some of that willpower that we see out of the boys from El Paso. Logan Ketterer 
Joined the expansion club a year ago, starting goalkeeper for Mark Lowry's side. Reached the playoffs oh, look and looked fantastic doing it. Slabicki, slow roller. In comes Ketterer to deny him. Ketterer, there's Slabicki. That's a challenge, Mike. Now we're having fun. Grab some popcorn and sit back, buddy. Juicy rebound put back in by Ab Smev. Slavicki grabs his third goal. And just like that, let's go up tempo a little bit. That's a code red download for sure. Slavicki played in all six games across all three matches for Philadelphia in the group stage, scored five or more in every game he played. Ketterer angling around. Angle too tight, circles around, back across. Slavicki there to defend. Slavicki following, and there's Ketterer inside the area. Uh oh. Uh oh! Along the goal line, smashed in by Ketterer. Abhorrent error by Philadelphia. An absolutely atrocious mistake here, Mike. Slavicki caught out in no man's land, has loads of room to work with to actually counter and go the other way. But instead, you got to be careful and you got to be proud as well. And I'm hungry. Pass the bread. Some things don't change. Ketterer essentially centered this against himself, and this time looked a bit more convincing. Ketterer smashes downfield. He's out of boost. There's no pad there. Misses the 100. Knocks it in front. Ketterer stoned Slavicki. 3-2 here with a minute 20 to play in game one of this best of five. That could have been a sealer. Ooh. Instead, Slavicki unable to get there. Ketterer, no. Slavicki downfield can take game one. 51 seconds remaining. It's a two-goal lead for Philadelphia. It's not necessarily the nail on the coffin, Mike, but the way things were going, Logan Ketterer had done well to work himself back in. This is some of the best we've seen him play, and I don't care about the 40 goals he put up against the Riverhounds. R.I.P. Bob Lilly. But that one goal just with a minute left. Nearly bounced in. Ketterer can't get it away. Slabicki grabs his fifth. It is right now his joint lowest scoring game thus far, but it might be enough. 16 seconds later, though, Mike, it's a quality response, and he's just pinning the pressure down in against Logan Ketterer. Put you in, coach. You need a sub, my friend. Game two is right around the corner. Don't worry. In this best of five, will game one's winner be nearly as influential as it was in the group stage? Oh, the Mickey in reverse. Ketterer halfway decent back check. 10 seconds to go. Philadelphia is going to win game one. All that's left is the margin. Philadelphia Union two. 
held to just five goals, and yet they win game one in this best of five in the knockout stage of USLE Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX. Southwest Chiropractic, serving El Paso area and relieving pain for more than 20 years. Not only do we treat auto, sports, and work-related injuries, but we also treat scoliosis, sciatica, back pain, disc injuries, chronic pain treatment, and we even manage stress. At Southwest Chiropractic, our patients are seen the same day. We provide gentle and effective care, and we accept most insurances. Schedule your appointment today and let us relieve your pain with three convenient locations in El Paso. Southwest Chiropractic, your health is our well-being. Call us today, 915-581-9619. Locomotive jerseys, shirts, hats, scarves, and so much more are available online in our team shop. Shop for the latest gear and receive free shipping and a percentage of all Locomotive FC merchandise sold online will benefit those affected by COVID-19 through the El Paso Locomotive FC Foundation. Get your Locos gear today. Welcome back, USLE Cup Rocket League Edition Game 2 of this best of five. Ketter and El Paso behind. Day one of four match days in the round of 16, Devin. And in the absence of sports on the whole, this has been a really nice oasis, I think, for a lot of people who follow the USL and a lot of people who follow eGaming as well. Ketterer tips it forward. The bounce won't help him much, and this will roll longingly across the goal line and out the other side. Slavicki carries it all the way down and in. Rolled up the post, off the bar, and in. They said it was much ado about nothing, but look at the little touch right at the end of it. Mike, honest question, if it's best out of five, does that mean if he wins the first two, we're allowed to forfeit the third and give him all three? No, absolutely not. Got it. I didn't know if there was a special rule put in that I wasn't aware of. <laughs> oh boy. Ketterer. Ketterer! Equalizing goal. Lovely touch. And you see the full motion at the end. Oh, that's the Logan Ketterer we came to know and love against King Kenny. R.I.P. Bob Lilly. As many times as I can, Mike, it's coming out. Mm, of course. The Riverhounds coach has to be disappointed. The defense was not up to snuff in that group. It was uh, the cellar dweller in group four. El Paso was the runner up. Thing on the group three champion, Philadelphia Union two. Ketterer pushes upfield. Slavicki is there. We figured the margin for error, Mike, would become much smaller come the knockout rounds, and I think we're starting to see that. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, oh. it's wide. Where every single touch seems to matter just a bit more, not because of the knockout rounds, but the level of overall play has really stricken itself. That rolls wide. Devin, we've seen Ev Smev go off the dribble at Ketterer a couple times, and Ketterer's been hit and miss in that endeavor. On his side, he's definitely lacked, but how about defensively where he started to notice those trends, Mike? Has some fun with it, just sits down. Nice little cup of coffee, afternoon tea, some scrumpets. You know how I like them. <laughs> Speaking of which, Extra my neighbor made me homemade shortbread. They were delightful. Yeah. Slavicki. Off the back wall, cleared away by Ketterer. We're still locked up at one in game two. Philly leads a game to nil in this best of five. Now Slavicki goes. Ketterer and him lock horns. Slavicki's got an opening to take the lead. Reaches down for that turbo, Mike, and how about that? Little chassis to chassis action. The captain 
Stuffing it away. Slabicki! I like that goal. Evan Slabicki, the senior account executive for group sales for the union in Philadelphia, was self proclaimed the captain of this team. Caterer running that hobble along. Caterer, a little nod to it. And this has to be a tap in. It is for Union 2. Starting to get nervous, Mike. Logan Caterer. This is not a good look, my friend. 3 1. Minus three last game. Got to be honest. The goal differential, the cumulative scoring is what gets me. Mike, did you know that we're adding up all the goals this round? And the winner is based upon. The difference there, it's actually not by game. That's also incorrect. Ketterer grabs one back. 102 seconds to go. Aggregate does not matter. Instead, this game two would lock up the real score line. I guess I'm reading my own memos and I apologize. I just realized they were not approved. So yes, we will go back to the best of five series. Full differential does not matter. Thank you, Mike. Ketterer overran it. That could have been a massive moment in this series. Slabicki driving along, and Ketterer stops behind the ball and pins it down. He keeps losing his boots a lot, like very early, overutilizing it, and Slabicki going the other way. By the way, Slabicki's favorite color is white. This has a chance! 3-3, three, three. excellent goal. Destroying the counter and firing it downfield. Can a color be a color? There's really no pigmentation in it. I mean, white, is that a color? I don't really know if I agree with that one. I'll reach out to the PR team. Could we be locked up in a game apiece in this best of five? Any mistake now individually magnified. Out goes Ketterer. Ketterer out in front. He takes the lead with 42 seconds to go in game two. Oh, Mike, it's Taco Tuesday, and that's a spicy meatball. What a finish. And Logan Ketterer, who has been so up front on social media, had a lead, and he's watched it evaporate. And the press conference won't be kind about this error. Hmm. Things that make you go, hmm. He just gives this to Ev Shmev. Thought it was an all-you-can-eat buffet. It's not the case. Could the next goal be decisive in game two? Ketterer bashes deep into the Philadelphia end. Cuts it off at midfield, but leaves it for Slabicki, who drives it forward. Oh. And oh. Ketterer there at the post, and he's off to the races on the counter. Can he center this with under 10 seconds to play? Could this be going to overtime in game two? Ketterer with time running out. Scores! Oh! El Paso wins game two in incredible fashion. Yo quiero tacos picantes, Logan Ketterer. This best of five. Level at one. What a start to the knockout stage of USL E Cup Rocket League Edition. Game three coming up. Hey, fans. I hope all of you are staying safe and healthy. All of us here at Locomotive can't wait to be on the pitch and be surrounded by all of your love and support. Uh, we can get through this with hope, with faith, and with a positive mindset. All love, guys. Take care.
The USL E-Cup is brought to you by HyperX. Check out the new Cloud Alpha S Blackout Edition at HyperXGaming.com. We didn't get many Game 3s. We only got two in the group stage. We've already got one here. That was guaranteed, but we're going to get a Game 4-2 because we are level at one game apiece. Union take Game 1. Locomotive take Game 2. Will this train stay on the tracks? Devin Kerr, Mike Watts on hand, and Slabicki, four seconds in, resting away the momentum. You won't like him when he's angry. Bounding ball, trouble brewing. Launched by Ketterer, he knows that's wide. Slabicki back the other direction. Ketterer, no, keeps it in front. Tried the flip reset with no help. Slabicki in on goal, and again he gets Ketterer to bite. Make it 2-0 to Union 2 inside a minute as they reestablish potentially their supremacy. Two nothing to Philadelphia. Mike, are you a Star Union Wars guy? Two. Hmm? Do you believe in the are you a Star Wars guy? Do you believe in the Supreme Leader? No. Nope. Ketterer, watch out. No, the leader or no Star Wars? I, I've come around on Star Wars, not around on the Supreme Leader. You're a Trekkie. <laughs> Didn't say that either. Um, Uh-oh. Ketterer got it away. Slabicki responds, but bounds out in front. Ketterer settles. Punched it off frame. Could this sneak in? It won't. Both stuck in the goal mouth. There's Ketterer. Race to the ball. Ketterer out in front. He's out of boost. Slavicki uses all of his and recovers to close down the angle, Dev. And all now Slavicki pokes it in. Hell of a different tape this time around, Mike. I say, for me, it just goes back to Logan Ketter's willingness to overutilize that boost button too early and much too often. Quite regularly, he's having to find himself backward. Little flip resets and having to chase the rate of play. When he's been successful, it's been the other way around. See if he can get back to it. I'm gonna get back to my half round. There he is with the boost. Circles back, grabs the 100 pad. He misses on the attempted clearance for Slabicki. He must, he does. And remember, Mike, in the best of five, even though he can still win the third game, it will only be his second win. He needs a third, which means he would have to win the fourth as well. Still with me? Mm hmm Does, does anyone want this? Knocked off the crossbar, fingertip stuff, and a follow. Oh, oh. Flipping backwards, Ketterer denies a second time. Good bump, and now this is toward the net and in! Life for El Paso. Just outside of two minutes, Mike, he's got a chance. Little 
in the middle of the arena. No celebration. Logan Caterer knows that he has a lot more work to do. And Evan Slabicki, who has the fifth stingiest defense in the Rocket League group stage, only allowing a goal and a half per game, three per match, still holds that significant three-goal lead with under two minutes to go. Slabicki <laughs> over the line! <laughs> Darkness falls across the land. <laughs> oh, look at the touch. Look at the touch. You love to see it. Go over there and apologize, young man. So Logan Catterer, who just crossed over 69 hours of gameplay all time in Rocket League, is playing from four goals behind when it looked like he may have been able to shave that lead down. Under 90 seconds to go. Oh, what a challenge, Mike. Look at him. Doesn't care that he's got the four goal cushion. And it hasn't really been a concern that he's been scoring less than other people, Mike, and that's why, because of the defensive efforts, you see him track back and he's willing to extend the plays whenever he gets the tiniest of chances. And how similar is this to the goal we just last saw? The first time he pokes to the right, this time he just continues straight forward. Dev, we've seen Philadelphia slowly become one of the better goal scoring teams in tight quarters. Half the ball over the line, but not the whole thing. El Paso won't steal one back now. And Slavicki will dribble it all the way in, which has become apropos for the Union. Seven one in game three. Ketterer grabs another one back. It's almost assuredly too little, too late. Like, I got to tell you, if I wasn't in broadcasting, my next job, I want to be the person who designs the rocket for these cars. You know, stage two, stage three. I think that'd be a great job. Sit at home and design digital rockets. What do you think? Love it. Ketterer gets another one back. Reggie Miller, hold your breath. Easy. The distance isn't isn't the same. Plus, you're not going to insult my man over there and say that he's a Nick, right? I mean, he's in that part of the country. But... <laughs> you're right. That's very offensive. Yeah, yeah, shout out to all you Knicks fans out there. You keep keep doing your thing. Ketterer waits, delivers, and there's Slabicki to quell the uprising. Ketterer looking to add one more at the depth. He can dribble this in, he will, but it won't change the overarching theme here. Union two, take game three to take a 2-1 lead. And the 7-4 finish, Mike, again. Logan Ketterer really didn't get into this match till about 60 seconds to go. And that's gonna be a bit frustrating for him, but hey, game four. Game four coming up in USL E Cup Rocket League Edition, brought to you by HyperX. Do the Union 2 move on to the quarterfinals? We'll find out. Mom, we have to talk. I'm getting a little too old for notes in my lunchbox. Really? Okay. See what else I put in there? Little Bites! Entman's Little Bites Muffins. Bye, Mommy, I love you! Made with real ingredients like blueberries, bananas, strawberries, and no high fructose corn syrup are always baked moist and delicious. Entman's Little Bites. The perfect portion of happiness.
Game 4 of USLE Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX between Philadelphia Union 2 and El Paso Locomotive. With Devin Kerr, Mike Watts on hand. Slabicki got a piece. And Je now pense not to play. problem in the situation, Michael. What do you think? What coach was that? No coach. Just, uh, I felt like the guys knew we were communicating about them. So if I switched my language, uh, they wouldn't be able to understand me. I immediately realized after that you don't speak French. So uh, my apologies. I'll text you. I speak the kind of French they speak in Philly. That's it. <laughs> With or without cheese whiz? <laughs> <laughs> Always wit whiz. Slavicki again grabs the opener. As El Paso backed into a corner now. They need to recover, but Philly leads in game four. Uh, Mike, wit whiz. You got to add a little provolone on there, too. I got to double the cheeses. Ev Smith knows it. He likes to be at the front of the line. He's out in front in game four. Slavicki being grinded from the side. He's still able to score. And again, he takes a multi-goal lead, this time in a decisive game. Oh, Mike, and just right up over the top, toasting him the entire way. I tell you, there's something a-brewing in the city of brotherly love. Flies Ketterer. Mike, I meant to ask you, if he flies in, doesn't he also fly out? Because he flies in, but then flies out, right? See what I'm saying? You're in, then you're out. Which one is it? It depends. Right now, Ketterer assures that he's going to stay in this game and try and stay in this tournament. so he doesn't get knocked out mm -hmm. of the knockout rounds. I get it. I see what you're doing. I'm picking up on it, Mike. Takes me a minute, but I'm there. Back goes Catterer. Catterer with the boost. Power shot goes wide. More efficient use of boost in this game. This goes all the way down. He knows he's not going to get a piece of that. He grabs the 100 boost, circles back. Oh, the technique. Catterer wide. And the other way, Slabicki. Knocks it wide of the oh. post. Follow up oh. effort. Own goal. That was certainly going wide. Mike had the uh, wherewithal to wait him out on one side. Played the little back heel. Got the counter going. Misses both strikes. You've got a friend in need. And you have a friend indeed. Logan Ketterer. Pick it up, buddy. Ketterer and El Paso playing for the El Paso Food and Beverage Workers Fund. The COVID-19 pandemic continues to have an adverse effect on most everybody worldwide. That cleared away from the line. Slabicki blows up Ketterer, but Ketterer got the touch beforehand. And the group four runner up get back into this. It's a great question, Mike, but I think more appropriate is can the group four runner up get back into this?
Ketterer. This has a chance. Can he touch it into the net? He can. Hold on a minute. Can't crown Philly yet. Oh, that's the HyperX Cloud fight in him. Lovely headsets distributing itself in the middle of this pitch, Mike. 3-2. Yes, I can read. And yes, I can add. A lot of things have been going on in the past couple days. This could be devastating. Instead, Slabicki can't get the finishing touch. One minute to go. Ketterer knocks it away. If he wins this game four, we're on to a decisive game five. Win or go home. If Philly wins, they win this best of five, three games to one. Slabicki, no, Slabicki, yes! Is he on to the quarterfinal? Play it off the wall, play it off the boards, play it off your head, play it off the car, play it off the tire, play it off the ground, play it off the arena, play it off the announcers, play it in the back of the net. It's the old trickery play, Mike. Bringing it back to life. El Paso's gonna need to take more risks. This risk doesn't pan out. It's a game of keep away. This is a must-have, and Slabicki able to slow it down. It appears there's just not enough time. Slabicki adds the exclamation point. Welcome to the quarterfinal, Philadelphia Union 2. Subaru Park is going to love that banner. El Paso locomotive on crush going to they're gonna bow out Mike but better to take a bow than to never have bowed at all you know what I mean and El Paso whose defense made it harder than any opponent Philly had seen so far still not enough to stop the Union Philadelphia Union to win this best of five three games to one and they're on to the next round the quarterfinal we'll wrap this one up when we return Southwest Chiropractic, serving El Paso area and relieving pain for more than 20 years. Not only do we treat auto, sports, and work-related injuries, but we also treat scoliosis, sciatica, back pain, disc injuries, chronic pain treatment, and we even manage stress. At Southwest Chiropractic, our patients are seen the same day. We provide gentle and effective care, and we accept most insurances. Schedule your appointment today and let us relieve your pain with three convenient locations in El Paso. Southwest Chiropractic, your health is our well-being. Call us today, 915-581-9619. Locomotive jerseys, shirts, hats, scarves, and so much more are available online in our team shop. Shop for the latest gear and receive free shipping, and a percentage of all Locomotive FC merchandise sold online will benefit those affected by COVID-19 through the El Paso Locomotive FC Foundation. Get your Locos gear today. Here are your highlights in U.S. LA Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX. Philadelphia Union 2 dispatch El Paso Locomotive, Devin. And Slabicki had maybe tougher competition than he had faced so far in the tournament. But Ketterer just can't, can't ignore those little mistakes. Here's the numbers that come at it for me, Mike. Yes, Philadelphia Union 2 was a top 10 scoring team. But for me, it was the defense. It was the fact that he was willing to sit back Take on his challengers. Let him come to him. Defensively, he's one of the more well-rounded players that we've seen the entire tournament. Now, offensively, can he turn it up when need be? Yes, he can. Now, he did it against an El Paso locomotive team that wasn't the best that we've seen, but carried a lot of momentum coming in. Unfortunately, their time will be dumb. Ev Smev, nice to see you again, buddy. Here is the updated bracket. The Group 3 champion is through to the next round. They await the winner of Tacoma and Austin, who play tonight in the quarterfinal in a best of five. For our tremendous crew, led by Sharni Yerke and Mike Friedman, Devin Kerr alongside Mike Watts saying watch Tacoma and Austin coming up next on ESPN3. 
Thanks for watching USL Cup Rocket League Edition brought to you by HyperX. Philadelphia Union 2, knock out the locomotive. So long for now.